Hey, welcome back to Cincy Fish Dudes. Got my boy Neil. We got the boat. We're on Rocky Fork Lake in Hillsboro, Ohio, and we're going to get about 98.4% of a solar eclipse today. So let's see how the fish are biting during a solar eclipse on this episode of. I'm gonna put these uh, special lenses on and see, see if we can see the uh, eclipse happening there. So far no fish yet, but the uh, Eclipse is definitely starting to happen a little bit. We got some cloud cover now for a little bit. And right now we're just hitting up points and structure. Got the eclipse glasses on just in case. I wanna take a peep. Oh wow. So we're at about 250 and I think we got about 20 minutes until we get as much as we're gonna get out of that eclipse. So yesterday on April 8th, we had a total solar eclipse pass over Mexico, United States, and Canada. And this eclipse was visible to about 32 million people in the U.S. alone. We are close to the path of totality, but we're about 98.4% eclipse, so we're not going to get that cool, complete darkness. But uh, we're going to see if we can catch a fish. The next total solar eclipse won't be visible in parts of the United States again until August of 2044. Alright, that's the alarm that says that in six minutes we will be at our peak. peak. Whoa, it is weird out. Take your sunglasses off. Yeah, it's almost like there's a thunderstorm it's like, about to kill us. It is, it's like... But then you have like a weird like glow. Not more than normal. But... Dude, that is so weird looking. Yes! What? He catches a fish right at our most complete solar. Oh my god, so weird. There it is, that's our peak. This is a nice fish, Paul. Dude, this is crazy. Neil catches a fish right when we're at our 100%. This is a nice fish. Best as we're gonna get. Hell yeah. What is this? It's gotta be a big It's a catfish if you say, what is this? <laughs> you, it's always it's a catfish. A big striper. Big striper. My man, pipe, dude, you caught a freaking fish right at the no. peak. What is this? You caught a fish at the peak. That's a bass. chunky bass. Neil, <laughs> dude, <laughs> um, yes, the solar eclipse is great luck for fishing because we haven't caught anything until we were at our best point of the day. Here it Not is. A bad one. Stay there. And there is the eclipse. This is the best RE Eclipse is going to get today. Looking awesome, man. It looks like we're faking it. It, it looks like we're faking <laughs> that catch at Eclipse, but that's as, that's as good as Eclipse gets for us today. Wow. Take that. There's gonna be like a million freaking eclipse pictures on social media today. Oh, yeah. Right away. Water temps are about 52.98, about 53 today. Neil's on with the second fish on the new big Joshi pattern. Look at that. Heck yeah. Heck yeah, it's working in an even little bit of a muddier waters. 
Trolling, trolling, trolling. Is that a fish or a snag? He's got a white crappie on the big joshy. Trolling. Trolling. What speed are we trolling at? Uh, like just one mile per hour. One mile per hour in these waters are about 54.35 degrees Fahrenheit. Come on, wind. Wow. Holy sh Okay. I didn't catch Jack today. Neil was hogging all the fish on what, lipless crankbaits and big joshies. Yep. Two on the big joshies, we got a crappie, a couple of bass. Um, but that the coolest thing about this whole day is we didn't catch anything. And then as soon as the eclipse was at its best point for our, our spot, Neil catches the bass of the day. And uh, I can't, you can't write a better video than that. And you also can't write a better weather. Weather, it's freaking amazing out here. We're like 70 degrees, cool breezes, and we're back in the boat again. Yeah, first day on the boat. Oh, this feels like winter is over when you're back on the boat again. But thank you for sticking around this long. And if you have stuck around this long, write the word. What you got for us? Booger. Booger in the comment <laughs> below. And we've known that you stuck around this long. We thank you for sticking around this long. And if you're new to us, we're on social media. Check that out. And if you want to see more of this idle, peaceful ASMR fishing, go ahead and subscribe. Hit that bell so you'll get notified every time we post. You've been watching Cincy Fish Dudes. We'll be back very soon with some exciting new news and all kinds of new things. So uh, thanks for sticking around, guys. We'll be back.